What's up guys welcome to Innovative West Tech YouTube channel and in today's video we are doing an unboxing of MI Band 3 yeah you heard it correctly it's MI Band 3 and this is an Indian retail unit exclusively on this channel so let's get started new to this channel hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get latest notification about technology Xiaomi India is going to launch this band on 27th November that's one week from now I've got already the Indian Indian retail unit and that this unit actually will uh, be the same which will be sold in India so uh, you are already aware of the uh, my band 2 this is the my band 2 which I have been using from a couple of uh, years actually and it's working well it's good but it uh, it has some uh, features which are uh, got an upgrade in my band 3 I unbox and see what's inside this package. So I uh, cut it from this side, and here we go. So as you can see from the from the unboxing, there is one box which has got a transparent uh, front and nothing else. On the back side, it's it's written in English. So obviously, this is an an uh, Indian retail unit. Uh, this is the same unit which is sold in India. So let's see uh, the specifications. What the specification says? Uh, its IP rating is 5 ATM. That's the most important thing which I have been saying. So let's uh, peel off this box first. Polishing and take it out. This polishing, keep it aside. And let's focus into this. So model number is there, battery is there, uh, uh, and then you can see fitness tracker, wristband, charging cable, user manual. All these are the package contents. IP rating is 5 ATM, so that means you can take this for uh, 50 meters deep inside the water, and nothing will happen to this. Now it's a bl black color. Obviously, it's in, sold in the black color only, and uh, the current input and battery capacity is one uh, 110 mAh. You can see the input voltage and Bluetooth 4.2 that's good actually so it will support most of the mobiles most of the new mobiles and it's manufactured by some Xiaomi corporation that's already written there some things are written in Chinese but this is the same the Indian retail unit will be the same as I know this because I got this from the same uh, place where uh, the Indian retail unit has to be sold so on the on the box back side only these informations are there and then you on the side it's semi logo everywhere you can see so now let's unbox it. This is the plastic uh, seal which you can take it off. So once we take this off, it comes like this. I guess it should come out. Okay, it should come out like this. So very good packing, thanks to Sony. Now let's take it out, this one. So as you can see here is the tracker. So we'll take off the tracker from this. Is the tracker in the box you can see the bracelet or the strap whatever you call it and then you have the user manual and it's a big user manual it's in different different languages because it's the same which will be sold as global globally also so it will have a big user manual lot of uh, uh, lot of languages are there so we can go through it later on but a big manual and let's peel off this and see what's here i think it will be the charging yeah it's the charging cable so you can put this band here and then you can charge it okay so let's keep these two things aside and let's see uh, what's into the this one if there is any battery or not so let's peel off this one it is actually powered on so battery is there so let's keep this also aside so from look and feel actually you can see this strap is the is uh, having a change it having it's having a upgrade on this as well and one thing you will notice on the band this time it's a touch screen so as you can see it is a touch screen and the and the it has got a button here so we have to pair this device and then we can get started so 
another thing which you will notice is the heart rate which is on the back side with an MI logo and this time the design has got a difference so what they have done is earlier the uh, module used to come out of the strap and it, it was very annoying for most of the customers most of the people in my band too also the same thing was happening if you can see the band too also it used to come out very easily and it used to fall but this time uh, they have actually put the edges here so it will not come out of the uh, strap easily and the, and the module will be fitted inside as you can see so that's one upgrade on the build and design the second upgrade is obviously the screen you can compare so it doesn't have a touch screen but now we have a touch screen and this screen is actually is 80 into 128 pixels so that's good actually earlier one was very less and it has the battery 110 mAh so it will last long for at least 20 days that's for sure so let, let's put into this one so putting into this is actually a very active job what I have done so now there is a it will not come out easily so this is a good good thing uh, actually whereas in this it was not that and you can see the screen is quite bigger and it's quite quite nice and uh, obviously the uh, screen resolution is also good so both have button but we'll have lot of features difference in this so this is the hands-on as you can see and it fits into the hand very nicely so here we go it's good actually in hand it's good look and feel into the hand not launched in india yet maybe in a week it is launched on 27 december i have made a separate video for the launch event you can go through it so let's let's actually uh, connect it with the device and see what's next so without wasting any time let's pair the new uh, mi band 3 and remove the old mi band 2 and see what's the difference what's the new features which is which is there so let's uh, add the device and we we'll go to so, so it is mi band 3 is is already paired so uh, we have to, to unpair it so now it's unpaired okay so so now that we'll uh, start unpair so you have to click here unpair it's very simple unpair it takes uh, some time to unpair it Remember my friends, Bluetooth should be on on your device so it will unpair easily. Otherwise it won't unpair. So as you can see now it is unpaired so we will try to uh, pair the new device. So we will keep this aside we will try to pair band. So now searching for band so remember my friends both the devices are kept here so uh, you have to see which one was by vibrating okay so go back and say again try so hold it in your hand and just see which one is vibrating Obviously, we have to pair this one, so we keep this aside. But we, know, we need to know which one is activated. So yeah, it's got vibrated, and now we have selected this one we have tapped it and now it is started pairing so you can see the pairing was successful and everything is coming in here in english because it's a retail unit which is sold in india unlike the chinese version so now that it has got paired you can see 
it has got cleared it will update the firmware let's wait for a while so now you can see that it has already updated 98 percent so it will complete in, in a while so now it has completed and we are good actually so we will see what is there it is trying to reboot I have enabled screen lock so that I will restore obviously. Now it is rebooting. So as you can see it is rebooted and connected to app update. So now it is connected. I will submit the resources. Again it is a fast activity so it won't take time. And you have to connect to your internet 3G, 4G or Wi-Fi just to upgrade this one so that's another catch here so all notifications everything whatever is happening is coming on the screen that's a good thing and it's a touch uh, touch screen OLED based touch screen so that's another good thing so we'll wait and we'll see what uh, are the resources which will be available so now it has done the updating of the resources and it's actually good for use so what we'll go is we'll go back and we'll see so as you can see 40% is the battery which I got in out of the box so that's one other good thing so let's see what are the what are the uh, things which is there so first of all what you will find is the time so you will find the time and date that's a good thing and then you have that steps count here you have to swipe up for the next thing so step count is 0 as of now then the heart rate is there and you can click here to measure it so this is the way you can measure it ok I haven't put in my hand so it, oh, it's obviously it will not, not measure so next is next is the uh, weather that's all another good thing so as you can see uh, the weather is there then we'll go to this is the exercise mode activity mode so it's very good here it will shows the, the exercise mode and then is the notifications notifications are also very important for us even we don't have the mobile with us you can find the, all the notifications here the another thing is uh, is more so more will have other features also and then the back to the watch face so basically all these things are there now i'll tell you how to actually go to the more things so you press on more there is a stopwatch this is another good feature which is there then you you can actually uh, go to the go to the silent mode so you can actually go to your phone and you can do the silent of your phone that's another good thing then you can go to find device is a very very nice actually uh, feature which uh, xiaomi has given in mi band 3 you can find your phone with this feature so that's very good thing what we have the information for the uh, my band three what's version it is running and everything so coming back again on this one the more uh, uh, about the notifications we can we can slide we can slide uh, the notification we can get the import, important notification like sms and everything whatever we are getting in the notification for the mobile app okay now activity as I told you, you can do swimming, you can do jogging, running, treadmill, everything and the exercise mode is here, so it's actually very good for this. Also the weather is very good, so you can actually come to know the weather uh, details, everything from the weather, this one. Then the steps counts also, it's there, so if you do any steps, uh, if you walk or you run, it will count the steps and everything. So the another important feature is the heart rate. So if you see heart rate, it will actually in the app, it will give you a lot of details about the heart rate. So you will have a pattern of uh, details in the, in the app where it will show uh, what's the heart rate and what is your uh, heart rate being measured every one minute or every five minute, whatever you set it like. So that's only another good important feature in the app. Now as you know, unlock features are there. There is another one feature for the face for the uh, clock face so that's uh, that comes into the screen unlock features only so when once you go to this uh, screen uh, basically in the more section 
you can find here more and when you slide here sorry when you slide when you slide here from left to right you can find a screen so silent find device screen in the screen section you can select and you have the face 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 uh, clock faces here you can select any of the clock faces it all depends upon your choices there are three clock faces which are available uh, in my opinion this one is the best so it has been set so these all are the clock faces which you can set actually that's a good feature actually and uh, what i told you was my find my device so when you say go to the find my device it will actually search your device and it will actually bring like this so basically if you have kept your mobile somewhere some uh, in the some uh, cupboard or somewhere uh, where you are not able to find in the home it will actually try to find it and it is actually applicable to 50 meters yes my friends it is actually applicable to 50 meters within 50 meters it will be able to find it so you can have off it so this is all is very good good thing obviously you can do a silent of your phone so basically your phone goes into the silent mode okay finger is off so uh, if you want to uh, remove from the silent mode the ringer will be on so this button will work in in the all all the uh, these activities so now coming up to the uh, up to the stopwatch you select this one it starts the stopwatch so you have a watch a basically a fitness tracker which has a stopwatch so it's actually all good for you to do some activities or whatever you want so this is a very good feature stop it it will stop so all this is working with touch screen and the button so it's actually very good and responsive so let's go back again let's come out of this, this one so as you can see so now in the, in, into the notification section I will click here I will see if any notifications will be here or not so any notifications will come it will come directly into the notification section so that's very good thing actually so I was just uh, talking about heart rate so you want to measure heart rate you have to click click this button and then you, you can start managing your heart rate now I have not put my hand so it will not measure the heart rate so th that's also a good thing obviously the weather is there steps is there so these all features are there and which uh, which makes this MI band 3 very nice and uh, handy and uh, basically good so the another good feature of this is like uh, to unlock the device as I told you you can unlock your device using this one so because this works with the Bluetooth unlock feature of the uh, MI UI and basically in all Android phones it is now available uh, you can go swimming with this because it will support 50 meters uh, up to 50 meters deep you can go swimming with it and it will not have any issues with the water so it's a water resistant IP it's not IP67 uh, but it's more good than that it's basically 5 ATM is what they call it so my friends buying this is a very very good idea and I will tell you it's worth it because it's a major upgrade from the MI Band 2 which is there in the market and actually in Indian in Indian pricing it will be near to about 2200 or 2100 it can be around 2500 also because the dollars value you are have gone high in India so just keep your eyes open on the on the event which is there on the September uh, 27th and you can actually see what's what's the pricing Xiaomi India is giving to this device so that's all for this video subscribe our channel and like share our videos thank you